I am weak, but thou art strong. Jesus, keep me from all wrong. I'll be satisfied as long as I walk. Let me walk close to thee. Just a closer walk with thee. Grant it, Jesus, is my plea. Daily walking close to thee. Let it be, dear Lord, let it be. Ask most older people if they've heard of Thomas Dorsey, and they'll think you mean the famous trombonist and big band leader. The Thomas Dorsey I'm going to tell you about was instead the father of modern black gospel music and a Chicago legend. Son of a minister and a piano teacher, at first he successfully played with blues and jazz bands after coming to Chicago from Georgia in what is termed the Great Migration. He studied music formally and was an agent for Paramount Records. In the 1920s, he began to record gospel music and led two church choirs. The story is told that Dorsey was getting ready to perform at a huge Christian gathering in St. Louis when he was handed a telegram that his wife, Nettie, had died in childbirth. He had misgivings about leaving her, but went anyway. As he prepared to go back to St. Louis for the funeral, he received another telegram to say that his infant son had also died. In his deep grief, he questioned whether God had been telling him to stay with his wife, and Dorsey was not able to find peace. Finally, in the quiet of a friend's home, a melody came to him as he was playing the piano. He wrote, As the Lord gave me these words and melody, he also healed my spirit. I learned that when we are in our deepest grief, when we feel farthest from God, this is when he is the closest, and when we are most open to his restoring power. And so I go on living for God willingly and joyfully until that day comes when he will take me and gently lead me home. Dorsey went on to direct music at Pilgrim Baptist Church in Chicago for 40 years and died at the age of 93. And the sacred music world is deeply indebted to him for his faith and his talent. Pray with me. God, I thank you for the gift of music. May these hymns continue to touch our hearts and our spirits anew so that we can continue our walk of faith hand in hand with you in good times and in bad times. Hear our prayers, and may your will be done in our lives. We ask this in the name of Jesus Christ, our Lord and Savior. Amen.